I just learned about my whoosh yesterday. And I read and watched some YouTube videos. Wanted to give it a try. Um, I used CompuTrainer for about 25, 30 years. Tried Zwift for a while. Zwift's okay. A lot of repetitive courses. Groovy, good too. Maybe better for me. The, the uh, pacers, the bots, not so great. I like the pacers on CompuTrainer better, but I thought I would try this new MyWoosh program and see what it's like. So I use um, an Apple TV for Ruby and Swift. With Swift, of course, I have to use a tablet of some sort. I used a Samsung Galaxy Tab, but I also have an iPad 10, which I have loaded with the Woosh, and I'm using a Dell Gaming 32-inch monitor, high refresh rate, and a, uh, a kicker. The trick to using my Woosh with the Apple TV is to go onto your Apple iPad and select mirroring and it now mirrors. Then all I need to do is go to my whoosh and I'm mirroring it, I'm basically ready to go. It's already found my Wahoo kicker show me my RPM, my heart rate. I have a Wahoo heart rate monitor that's both Bluetooth and Ant Plus. Press ride. I'm going to do a free ride. Pick a course and ride. It's a pretty quick interface. Picks it up pretty quickly. And here we go. We're already going. So this is the program. The graphics aren't quite as clear as maybe they could be. I think maybe Ruby's a little clearer. It's comparable with Zwift. The uh, amount of other people on Zwift is, of course, phenomenally higher. And uh, the number of people on Ruby depends on which course you pick, but it's pretty, pretty sparsely populated also. So, for a free program, for as long as it lasts, I'm going to give it a try. And using your Apple TV with a monitor, all you have to do is mirror it from your iPad, or I imagine your iPhone, uh, and you're ready to go. Now I will caution you this, my older iPad Air 2018 would not load the program. I'm going to assume it needs a specific level of processing power and you might not have that on your phone unless it's a new late model version. So there we go. Thanks for watching.